was ordered Requiem. Find Valentina. Destroy her army. Or your pilot will be bled dry. Hey everyone, it's an aging zombie here. Continuing my journey through the Cold War Zombies maps. I am on to Mauer der Toten. So let's see if I can get this Easter egg done. Now, truth be told, I did get to the boss on this uh, map already once. So I made it to the boss. I was all excited. I had completed all the Easter egg steps and I died like ridiculously fast. <laughs> um, so I was like, I kind of really want to try this again because I had a lot of fun on this map. Oh, hello. <laughs> Uh, I had a lot of fun on this map, so figured I'd give it a second shot here. Well, actually, <laughs> I've been trying it a couple times and uh, just keep failing. Um, so back in here, see if I can make it to the boss. See if I can get further. I'm still not necessarily gonna like like aim at trying to well i'm aiming to try and beat the boss but if i don't beat the boss that's fine i just rather get further than i than i did get okay so flip that need to go get one more power cell or fuse i guess And there we go, power on. So now I'm gonna head up top. Now before I activate the Pack-a-Punch, I like to go out into the fields here and kind of dig up these. It's a two-fold thing. It's a nice amount of salvage that you get. And then the other is that you get the satellite piece that you need to upgrade Klaus. I am going to first, I guess not. I was going to say, I'm going to try and get it down to like one zombie. Oh, I can just take this nuke. Maybe that will. There we go. Oh, here's a pile. And there's the dish. But I'm still going to kind of dig these up. Free salvage. It's nice. Okay, so now let's go activate this guy. And I'm gonna just plant that. <laughs> oh boy. Clear up a couple of these. And there we go. Okay, so now I do need brain rot. Because I now I'm going to go try and get the hands for Klaus. So to turn on Klaus, there are two things you need. You need a battery and you need his hands back. And to get the hands, you need brain rot to get into a room in this hotel here. And then the battery comes from round 10. There is a special zombie that spawns and he drops a battery. All right, so I've got enough for brain rot. So I'm gonna go buy that and then head up to the room. Okay, so we are in room 305. So you have to turn a zombie, they will destroy this uh, door here. And then you can get Klaus's hands. And it also has the safe that we will need later. And here's Klaus's hands. Alright, so now I'm going to go back outside onto the ground and just kind of 
farm zombies until I get to round 10. I'm also going to... Uh, 2,500. I'm also going to switch back to cryo freeze when I get the chance because the special zombie that spawns that has the battery uh, has a damage weakness to cryo freeze. So helps when you're fighting them, especially because uh, I don't know the name of that special zombie, like the type it is. It's got a flamethrower, and it uh, it damages it damages you pretty good. So it's better to kind of get them down quick. And I recently purchased some uh, upgrades for cryo freeze, so we should do a little bit better now. All right, so we are at round ten. So at the start of this round, that special zombie should spawn. Bummer, my insta-kill is already gone. Okay, I hear him. Where are you, though? Is the question. There you are. Ooh, don't want to go down to zombies coming up behind me. Ooh, let's grab this. That's nice. Okay, so he should have dropped a battery. Oh, there it is. Just missed grabbing it. There's the battery. Oh, and there's something else. Some other type of document. Okay, Klaus, let's get you turned on. Finally. Have you any idea how bored I was just waiting for something to do? Sorry. Hello. I am Klaus. Trust me, I am here to help. All right, let's go. So we'll bring him over here, and he will interact with this locker here, which will give us a black light that will help us in getting the numbers to the safe. Sometimes what he then requires illumination. Okay, so. One of the numbers should be in this passageway. Well, I want to take out this disciple as quick as I can. Oop. Okay, here we go. So 29. And this will be the second number. The third number always spawns in the grocery store over here. We can see it would be the third number. Tango removed. Now I just have to find that number. While also dealing with hordes of zombies. Oh, here it is. Oh, four. Okay. I have yet to see it on the shelves. I've always seen it on walls, so that's why I couldn't find it. Okay, so the third number is going to be 04. There we go, 38. Okay, so the last number is 38. Okay, so it was... 4, 29, and then 38. Or not. Oh, I just real. I have the numbers right. I just realized I have them in the wrong order. So, it should be... 38, 38 should be the first one, 38, uh, 
right? 38, 29, and then... Oh, four. There it is. Aha. I am the C -R -B -R -S. Okay. So before I move on to the next step, which is typically I will go and upgrade Klaus, I'm going to go collect two more items that will be needed down the road. One is on the spawn building. Once you have the wonder weapon, you can shoot that radio tower. Grab the antenna. And then the next item is going to be down in an electronics store. And so in this electronics store, there are these radios around, and you just shoot them, and it should spawn the item that you're looking for. There it is. Okay, and before I go work on upgrading Klaus, which will take place back in that factory, I am going to come down here and pack a punch this wonder weapon. And see if I can upgrade this at all. I cannot, but let me get some better armor there. I still don't fully understand how armor works in this game. Because I know for Modern Warfare Zombies, you know, your armor goes down before your health does. But seemingly in this game, uh, your health will go down before your armor does. So I haven't really figured out, like, why that is. <laughs> Alright, so you place that dish that I got earlier there. And then bring Klaus down into here, tell him to just stay there. And then at some point, this computer will turn green, which means you can start upgrading Klaus. Now, I don't know... I don't know if it's, like, time-based before this is ready. Is it Klaus needs a certain number of kills before it's ready? Haven't really figured that out. It normally takes, because, you know, Klaus will go away after a while, like, his, you know, battery will deplete. Um, oh, ouchie. Um, and it seems to be, normally it takes two, two of him at full battery to be able to get to the stage where you can upgrade him. I'll take that. Oh, okay, so the computer is ready. So he should jump on there now and start his upgrade process. Oh, no, he, uh... <laughs> oh, hello. He just unfortunately ran out of his power. Okay, so I'll have to wait until he recharges, but next, next time he comes in, he will be ready to upgrade. Oh, he is. Hey, all right. So, should be able to upgrade him now. I'll wait for him to come in here and get in that machine before I... So now you just gotta protect him as he upgrades and just for this amount of time here. Oh, I got insta kill, nice. Nice, alright, so he is now upgraded to level 2. Oh, uh, nope. I wanted that. Actually, I want this upgrade because I need it for the next step. Uh, and my armor's all full. Okay, so I'm going to go back down to the uh, street. I'm going to work on getting... I don't know why I keep coming up here when I know the staircase is down here. But 
I'm gonna work uh, on getting this round down to like one zombie and then once Klaus is recharged, I will move on to the next step. So let's go down to the sewers, down to where Klaus is, because that is where the next step will take place, is down here. And before I go do that, I am going to quickly shoot that to get this part here, the electronic board. Oh, no, not that. Uh, this. Activate Klaus. Miss me? Cannot say I missed you. I guess if you spam this, he doesn't shoot zombies. But I've yet to... <laughs> Sometimes he does, so I don't know. So I want him to interact with that. Nice. Okay. Now, that's why I think you need this specific... Wonder Weapon Attachment to break through on that. Okay, so we'll shoot that computer, which will allow me to get these. However, I do need to wait until Klaus is no longer here. Is it Klaus's little radio thing takes over my equipment slot? Oh, we'll take you out really quick. Oh boy, as quick as I can, without going down. Oh, he's painful. Klaus is done. Okay, so now I can grab this, and then I'm also going to grab these containers here. Now we gotta go find these can or containers to place these canisters and the trap in. Uh, let's see, was there one over here? So we've got no. Oh yes, there it is. Okay, so let me thin up the herd here. All right, my uh, insta kill is gone, so we're gonna switch back to the wonder weapon. Yeah, let's just do the nuke. Okay, so let's interact with this. So we'll place the canister. You throw the trap, and it will spawn some of those electric guys. You kill off the electric guys, and it gets their souls. Okay, and so we grab this. And take it back. Whoa. Place that in there. Nicely done. Okay. Oh, wow. I almost went down there. Don't forget to grab another one of these. The first time I made it to the boss, I totally forgot to grab another one of those. Place that. Throw that. Got you. So let's drop that. Oh boy. God, those things are so brutal. No, not cool, not cool. Oh gosh, man, those explosions just are brutal. Okay, so kind of back to full fighting capacity here. Alright, 
Let's grab you. Now let's make the long run. All right. Yes, okay. I'm relatively safe. <laughs> Okay, so now I should have to, oh yes, I need Klaus again. I need him to interact with the train. I need him to come to that train track right there. Stop the train for me. Uh, what? Okay, Klaus is ready again, and I've realized the errors of my way. I forgot to, uh, hit this. Switch the tracks. Now this should work. There we go. We need that. And that. There we go. If you just remember the right steps, it makes things a little bit easier. Now that I have a warhead, we can place it here. Okay, so insert this here, and get it to that image. Oh, well would you know, I have those items. Oh, Klaus is recharging. I can't interact with him. Oh, okay. Well, I gotta wait. Oh, here we go. Job well done. I have now hacked into the satellite. Access terminals are now available around the city. Knock yourself out. That way, I do not have to. The Reich knew the war was lost. Okay, so now that dialogue's done, we'll interact with that. And now we head up. Ran down from the heavens. Good breach, good breach. Apex tethered. And the area where we know. craft, because the, the megaton is going to drop. Um, radiation stuff. And you craft it over in this area, so I'm going to bring them over here. Okay. So we'll grab this. Build it. So now we gotta take um, one to each side of the zip line here.
So we'll place that there. So there should be the second one here. We'll grab this. Craft again. that up and now we go to the other side pause it on this side here boom it should drop a smaller one that we then have to take down oh. 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 oh boy that scared me <laughs> um, we take this smaller one down to there it is Take it down to where the uh, little radioactive thing is going on. Place it in there, and then we have to do that whole thing one more time. Well, well, how the tables have turned. What do you want now? That's weird. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, I was trying to interact with this, and I couldn't interact with it. I brought in Klaus, and then all of a sudden I could interact with it. Um, kind of weird. I didn't have to do that before, and I was because I was trying to keep my round at 29. But that's okay. Klaus can kind of help me get through this. I do hate these rounds, though, where it's just all these red things, and... Last time, I didn't even go up there. They just came down to me, eventually. There he is. Ooh, boy. Alright, they're split now. Take that armor. Okay, let's grab. Oh, it like wouldn't let me interact with it. Pick up that. Okay, so craft away here. Grab that. Oh, here's the other one. I kind of forgot where I had killed them. craft this and then I'm gonna let my health kind of reheal a little bit and kind of thin the herd here okay so we'll place that there whoa hello Oh no. <laughs> uh, before I grab that, I am going to work on taking some of this stuff out. I do not want to go down now. Pick that up. Okay, so, back to the boss fight. Okay, and I will be smarter this time around. Oh, can I not? Oh, it's 10,000. Ooh, wow. But I at least have this pack punch three this time. I did not before. Alright, let's go. I can last longer this time, I promise. That's what took me out the first time. That attack. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Ooh, ooh, careful.
Okay, good, good, good. Let's use the last four seconds of uh, the insta kill there, even though now it's completely gone. Oh no, not that guy! Yes. Nuke. Nice. Fortunately, I'm out of ammo, so I'm going to have to... Oh, ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Got too cocky there. Let's buy ammo. Ooh. Oh, boy. I stayed out there way too long. knew that was coming and I just didn't do anything. No. Oh no. No, 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 no. I forgot I don't like this one. This attachment's terrible. We're just going to burn the ammo on this. That's it. No one can beat this drink, baby. Now stay there. Oh my goodness, this is brutal. Oop. Oh, no, don't want to get out. No. Oh. That's right. I should probably use my equipment. I just realized I have uh, equipment. This is wild. I just don't feel like I'm doing enough damage to her. Is her health reviving too? Oh, it is. What the heck? Oh my gosh. I'm never going to win this. I gotta be a little more aggressive on this when she's down and out. Oh. Those things. Oh, come on! I got this. Oh no! No. I swear I'm like. I feel like I'm doing damage to her, but then it's like. I look and it's like, nope, her health, fully back.
Okay. Ooh, ooh. Definitely survived longer, but man, I am just. I feel like I'm doing nothing to her. Why is she immune? Oh. I gotta take out everything that's healing her. So these tormentors that come out uh, don't really... Oh, that's that dangerous one. <laughs> No, 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 no. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness gracious. Oh, man. Well, man, that is, that is one tough fight. Uh, I mean, even the first time I had made it there, I, like I said, I went down really quick, and I just thought it was, like, lack of preparation. Uh, I felt more prepared on that. I know I didn't have all the perks, but I had everything PAP 3, and my secondary, or, like, my main gun, not the Wonder Weapon. I did have, uh, like, a step below Legendary. So, uh, what is that, Epic? Or not Epic. Yeah, I think epic. Um, thought I could get it done. I lasted longer, but man, she is she is one tough fight. Maybe I was playing it a little too reserved by like kind of staying in that corner under the staircase. Maybe I should have been a little more aggressive. Because um, I really think the main thing is the the like shard attack. I think that's like the main thing that really does massive amount of damage. So I probably should have just stayed out there a little bit more um, to fight off the hordes and not stay under that staircase. But, you know, you live and you learn. This was a very fun map. I liked this Easter egg, uh, like, main quest a lot. Klaus was a fun character. Uh, it was cool having to interact with him. Plus, the map, I think just the map itself was... It was a beautiful map. I liked the lighting, the environment, and everything. So, my favorite so far. So, the last map I do have to try to get through is Forsaken. And then I will be done with the Cold War stuff. And especially because Black Ops 6 is right around the corner at this point. So I hope everyone enjoyed this video. Until the next one, peace.